I picked Kalamazoo College uh, because when I was being recruited, I just felt very comfortable with the team. I really liked the, the family atmosphere that, you know, the older guys really showed me early on um, from the time I was in high school being recruited to when I came here as a freshman. And it just, you develop ex a lot of camaraderie very quickly. And so that made my experience at Kalamazoo phenomenal. Uh, I grew up around Kalamazoo because of him. I was coming to basketball games for four years, uh, met a lot of his friends and saw the, the bond that they had. Um, and so when I was getting ready to come to college, um, his coach was actually recruiting me. And I came in on a recruiting trip, met some of the guys that I was going to be coming to school with. And same thing, built a great bond with them. And once we got here, I graduated with seven other people. And still today, they're my best friends. And um, I wouldn't trade that for the world. So, what I remember vividly, and it isn't necessarily my best experience, but I, what sticks with me forever is, you know, the dark days in winter where you're in the gym with your brothers and, you know, you're trying to get better, you're, you're taking care of your schoolwork, you're trying to take care of your body, and just building that, you know, family mentality is something that I really cherished in my experience here at Kalamazoo. And very similar to like Carter said, I graduated with seven other guys. We came in together, we left together, and to this day we're still extremely close, even now that we live all over the country, everyone's got families, and it's been extremely rewarding to see how successful the guys that I grew up with here at Kalamazoo have become, you know, out in the world. My favorite experience was junior year. Um, the basketball team had a tournament in Tampa. Um, so we went down, I think we were down there for five days, um, played in a tournament, played two really good games. Um, the championship game went in overtime. Um, but then afterwards, we just got to hang out, walk around Tampa, um, and just hang out with the guys. And it was a great experience, kind of getting away from K, um, but still having all your friends there and having a good time. So. I'm probably one of Kay's biggest supporters on the east side of Michigan as far as the experience as a whole. Uh, there's no other school, I believe, on this planet that could have provided me. One, uh, a band of brothers that I created here. Two, the education to where I felt pr very or overly prepared to either go on to grad school and or get into the workforce right away. Uh, currently, I'm a wealth management advisor uh, with a successful firm on the east side of Michigan, and I've been doing that for about 10 years, and that was straight out of college. So uh, I feel that Kalamazoo prepares its student athletes arguably better than any other college in the state um, and possibly the Midwest. And I can speak from the grad school aspect. Um, I'm currently doing my JD MBA at DePaul University, and I feel as if K College prepared me way better than a lot of other my, other my classmates at DePaul um, when it comes to classes, doing homework, being prepared for class. Um, and without K, I don't think I could be doing as well or even be at the program I'm at uh, right now. He won't brag about himself, but I think you're in the top five percent of your I, score right now. I'm doing well. Yes. Okay. Also, I'd like to put a side note, during my tenure at Kalamazoo, I, we played hoops with at least five valedictorians on my team at any given time. Uh, we've had, in my group of friends, at least three valedictorians from law school, I think one from med school, and it, it's amazing the type of education that you get here at Kalamazoo that takes smart kids and turns them into you know, borderline genius. Uh, wow, that's a great question. Uh, a couple of reasons, um, actually three. One was the opportunity to continue play ba to play basketball um, after high school. And um, two was proximity to home. I wanted my parents to be able to watch me play. I wanted my family to be close to me. Um, and it was, um, far enough where I felt like I was away from home, but close enough where I could go back for a weekend. Uh, and then three was the school, um, the academics, um, and most importantly was the academics. Um, my dad always pushed me to 
go to a great school and uh, that was his deal with me was he would pay for school if I went to a good school and got good grades and um, you know Kay's top notch in that respect. Experience. Okay I will do two best experiences. <laughs> one academic and one athletic. Uh, I'll start with the academic. The first was um, a combination of study abroad and my SIP. Um, going to France for three months was an unbelievable experience. I did it with three of my teammates. Um, something we'll remember for the rest of our lives. We won a three on three tournament over there, just FYI. And then um, the second was my SIP. And I was able to combine my studies in economics with my passion for sports and did a um, research report on the uh, economic impacts of hosting the Summer Olympics. So that was an awesome experience in terms of academics. Uh, athletics, um, I, I, I just have to say the, uh, the guys on my team I'm completely best friends with and will be best friends with them for the rest of my life. So the camaraderie um, and just the family that we had uh, was unbelievable. Um, in terms of preparing me for life after K, um, there were a lot of different uh, resources that we had here, uh, including our career center, which I worked for for a year. Um, the department chairs, our professors, uh, they were unbelievable and instrumental in terms of molding me into who I am today. So uh, I really credit Kay with providing me with the communication skills that I have, the leadership skills that I have, uh, being able to write and speak. Um, uh, you know, you're going to learn on the job the skills that you need, but if you don't have those things, you're going to be you're going to be screwed. So. Um, you really need those things, and Kay prepared me for all of that in terms of an internship, studying abroad, putting me in uncomfortable situations, and pushing me to be my best. Um, Kay did a great job of doing that. Somebody <coughs> can choose Kalamazoo College because you will become a better person, you will have an unbelievable experience, and you'll be prepared for the rest of your life.